Hi bros, in today's episode I've got something special, newest adapter from Goran for our Xiaomi is M365, thanks to it we will be able to build two-wheel drive or just move motor from the front wheel to the rear one and install this brake because as you can see we've got this extra spot to install this brake so yeah this is this newest adapter and like always quality of Goran products looks like this so do I have to say something more it's insanely done super shiny and I literally cannot say nothing about about the quality As you can see we've got two versions which looks almost the same, almost, because there is small but quite important difference. Here we've got five holes for the disc brake, as you can see this one will fit to standard Xiaomi disc, so to this tiny one, but if you'd like to install some MTB disc, which can look just ridiculous, just check this one out then you have to choose version with six holes because you will be able to mount MTB disc brakes and just check how it looks yeah it looks nice but this one is 140 meters and you need some extra adapter for the brake this thing which is squeezing the disc I forgot the name but yeah all can be done and your disc brake could look like this man nice also in the box you will find these two adapters thanks to them you'll be able to install motor on the real wheel long time ago i did tutorial how to install it so just check the description there is a link to my website when i show it step by step how to install these two and the quality what i can say more you can see that it's perfectly done so i can feel that this is metal one so man i really don't have to say nothing more just Goran products and super shiny and this is actually a nice touch we've got genuine Koyo bearing with this holographic thing so for sure this one is genuine one and we have to install this bearing check this stuff I think inside yeah somewhere over here like this I will show you how to do it we've got also some extra screws so those we have to mount around this adapter so over here and thanks to it we will secure this adapter on the motor and those ones are to secure this brake to the adapter so you have to install those over here everything fits perfect nice and this extra wire is if you would like to install motor on the rear wheel then as you know front wheel is rotating forward but when you rotate the wheel 180 degrees then the rotation will be backward that's why you need this adapter so it will change face on the sensor and also you have to change two wires on the motherboard so not the middle one but this outside one just swap it and it will work so nice to have this adapter in the box but all i will show you grease for bearings You need something like this, so bigger screw with two washers on the one side, actually big washers, and two extra ones on the other side. Let's place it more or less straight. Looks like this, and now we have to rotate this top part. As you can see, the bearing is pushing in. Ok, 
thing. Crotches. Nicely done, pirate. I know, I know. <laughs> yeah, it's pretty nice. Koyo. Is it still working? Yes, it is. There is my old Xiaomi project. Two wheel drive built in two VCs. So we've got motor on the back and motor on the front. Last week I had some free time, I did small tests and this thing is just mental. You know that Xiaomi is quite small, it's like pocket size, super light. But thanks to two motors and VECs, this thing behaves more like small Boyeda or Yano Bike T85. Every single time when you hit full throttle, you have to hold string bar pretty hard, otherwise scoot will go without you, like literally. I set like 30 amps per motor in VEC, but we can also set 50 amps, so just wait for next episodes. This thing is just crazy. So let me show you that everything is working when I hit the standard Xiaomi throttle. Then the motors are spinning actually quite fast, because I installed 12S battery, 15 amps. So the speed now is easily over 40 km per hour, but my plan is to install even 13 or 14 s to achieve 50 km per hour. I know that is dangerous, but we like to do dangerous things, bros, do we? So what is the plan? I have to remove rear motor, then I will have to remove the side shell of the motor, install this new shiny one from Goran, then I will be able to install back mechanical disc brake. You ask me so many times, is it possible to install disc brake on Xiaomi 2 with drive? Now, thanks to Goran, it's possible. And I think it could be quite useful because I know that VSC has one of the best motor braking system on the whole market. You can set many factors like amperages, wattages, ABS, just everything what you can imagine. But if you would like to use this code at over 40 km per hour, then some extra mechanical disc brake could be quite useful. So let's do it. 